Hey everyone, my name is Max Wild. I'm a producer and saxophone player in New York City, and I also teach the Music Foundations course at Dubspot, both here in New York and at our online school. Music Foundations teaches you about how to make beats, it teaches you about constructing melodies, bass lines, and chord progressions, and it also teaches you about the rich musical heritage of electronic dance music. This is part one of a three-part tutorial in which I'll be showing you how to use seventh chords to spice up your harmonic progressions. So first of all, what is a seventh chord? A seventh chord is four notes. In the case of the major seventh chord, these four notes. Now the seventh chord gets its name from the seventh, which is this note, which is the interval of a seventh above the root. Now, it also happens to be the seventh note of the scale. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So let's take a look at the major seventh chord and what intervals it is made of. So first we have the root, then we have the third, the fifth, and the seventh. The interval from the root to the third is a major third, or four half steps. One, two, three, four. It's also the third note of the scale. One, two, three. Then we have the fifth, which is a perfect fifth above the root, or seven half steps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's also the fifth note of the scale. And then finally, the top note is the seventh, which is a major seventh interval, which is 11 half steps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And it's also the seventh note of the scale. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that is the major seventh chord. Let's talk a minute about the sound of the major seventh. When you're making music, you really want to use seventh chords to uh, create a certain feeling. Now, generally speaking, seventh chords are going to sound a lot more jazzy than just your regular triads. A major triad sounds like this. A major seventh chord sounds like this. Now, the major seventh chord in particular sounds very mellow. It sounds unresolved. And it sounds quite bright, at least to my ear. So let's make a chord progression now using the major seventh chord. In order to do that, I'm just going to take the major seventh chord shape and move it around the keyboard. Now, since I know the major seventh chord shape very well, I can just do that on the fly. But uh, it might, may take some practice. So here's C major seventh. Here's B flat major seventh, A flat or G sharp major seventh, F sharp or G flat major seventh, E major seventh. Now I'm going to create a harmonic progression using those chords. C major seventh, G sharp major seventh, F sharp major seventh back to G sharp major 7th and ending on A sharp major 7th. I put together a beat, I recorded the chords and then I put a melody and a bass line on top of that with the chords. It sounds something like this. So I'm going to record that chord progression along to some drums to start a track.
So the major seventh chord actually comes straight out of the major scale. As we can see, here we have C major seven, which comes right out of the C major scale. So if we have um, C major seventh, we can use the C major scale. Here's C major seventh, and I can use the C major scale for my melodies. If I go to G sharp major seventh, I can use the G sharp major scale. If I go to F sharp major seventh, I can use the F sharp major scale. Or if I go to A sharp major seventh, I can use the A sharp major scale. Okay, so now we've finished our four bar chord sequence using just major seventh chords. I hope you find this method useful to spice up your chord progressions. You can find out more information about our courses in New York, Los Angeles, and online at dubspot.com. And if you'd like to check out my music and how I use seventh chords, you can go to mynameismoa.com. I just launched a new project under the name Moa. Thanks all for watching. See you next time and stay tuned for part two on minor seventh chords. Welcome to Dubspot. We believe in providing you hands-on experience right away. Whether you're completely new to music and want to turn the sounds in your head into a musical reality, or you're an experienced artist looking to refine your skills and add new tools to your arsenal, we're ready to meet you at your level. For students of all ages, all levels, and all styles of music, Dubspot is here to help you achieve your goals. With course offerings both online wherever you are and at our school in the heart of New York City, we are ready to guide you through the next phase of your musical transformation. Whether you want to produce music, DJ, or do both, you've come to the right place. Come explore Dubspot for yourself. Become a part of our community and make music.